Uh, feline respiratory diseases really fall into about three different categories. There's the infectious type. Um, there's a type that you will get uh, genetically. It may be from a heart disease. Um, and then there's an autoimmune or an allergic type. Uh, the infectious types that we're talking about are mainly uh, dealing with viral diseases. Uh, and those are the type of things you want to get your kitten or cat vaccinated against. Uh, it could be a calissivirus, a herpes virus, a rhinovirus. Those are all upper respiratory diseases where you see these little kittens with runny eyes and nose. Sometimes they can't open their eyes and you have to wipe them off or they're sneezing all the time with yellow or green mucus and having a lot of difficulty. Um, those are fairly common, and especially in uh, large households that have lots of cats uh, or cats that are going outside or, or cats that have been orphaned because maybe they're not getting the right uh, um, antibodies from the, from the mom, uh, from the queen when they, when they were born. Uh, the other type of diseases, um, the autoimmune or the allergic type of diseases are is something as simple, or not as simple, but as common as asthma in people. Cat asthma is a very common problem, a respiratory problem. Uh, and it can be quite severe and debilitating. A lot of times we'll see cats that are almost in respiratory distress. They're coming to the clinic or people say they're turning blue and their mouth is open, they can hardly breathe. And they could just, because they're having an asthmatic reaction. And uh, they can die that way. But uh, fortunately, if you treat them properly, they, they can have a, a long and healthy life and never run into that sort of problem. The other third one, uh, cardiac problems, which which you would think if it's a heart problem, it's really not a respiratory problem, but a lot of heart disease ends up being a respiratory disease, where if there's a heartworm that actually exists in cats that can cause some uh, breathing difficulty. Um, and there's also uh, other, other causes that can cause heart disease, just uh, a cat can have an enlarged heart, either congenitally enlarged, or it can happen because of other problems that's going on, and that enlarged heart causes uh, circulation problems and the cat's having difficulty breathing because possibly there's fluid on the lungs and that would be termed a respiratory disease even though it's a heart problem that's caused secondary causing a, the, uh, the respiratory problem. So you have to, again, a lot of situations, you identify why the cat's having a problem and many times it's treatable.